Well, hi, welcome back to Eagle Talk. I'm Paige. I'm Skylar. Oh, and I'm Mr. Berman. <laughs> welcome. So, today we're going to be talking about Link, but before we get there, we do have another icebreaker question this week. So, so since you're teaching the class real history, if you, could, if you could pick one all-time favorite movie. Oh, that's a tough one. Um, can I pick two? You can. Okay. I liked our man, uh, Godfrey, the one about the butler who... Yeah, okay. Yeah. Me and Josh talk about that one all the time. Yeah. We, we really like that movie. It's just one of those movies that uh, captures the, 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 the desperation and the hope that exists during the Great Depression. Yeah. I think it's, it's a great film. And I think the other one is The Best Years of Our Lives, which I know a lot of people thought was too slow, but it's yeah. uh, the returning home from... From the war. Yeah. And it okay. just, it, it's kind of a... You watch all the glorious World War II movies, and then you see this. Like, what is it like to come home? Yeah, afterwards. It's, yeah, it's a really good juxtaposition for for yeah. teaching the war. I like both of those ones. Those are two of the good ones I thought in them in that class. Yeah, apparently everyone hated Gone with the Wind. <laughs> I mean, it, <laughs> what did it take? Five <laughs> class periods? It, it was a long one. Yeah, it was a doozy. What, for sure. What class are you guys talking about? Real history. Yeah, it's American history through film. Okay. It's, it was a new elective we taught for the first time this year. Oh. And it was wonderful. Thank Love you. I'm glad you liked it. It was awesome. It was so enjoyable. Cool. Yeah, I didn't take that class, so I don't have an opinion, but those sound like they would be good movies. <laughs> <laughs> it so, was. It was really good. Yeah. The class was awesome. Wait, good. what were, what was it about? It's you, we study history through the different um, movies. periods. Yeah. yeah, so we watch movies like obviously like from the Civil War, Revolutionary War. There's no movies that really exist, but yeah. there are movies that exist about that time. So we watch them and say, okay, what does this say about the Revolutionary War? Or what or what does it say about the time it was made? Um, so just basically how we study history, how history is presented. It's a good class. People like. Oh, yeah. Great. Thanks. <laughs> So, <laughs> another thing that you are involved in besides teaching that class is Link. Yeah. So, what is like? What is Link? Link is a program that we do here at the high school to welcome uh, incoming freshmen into the building and into the high school culture. Okay. So I'm pretty sure it's called something different at the middle school now, but it's basically when we web. were there. Yeah. Web. Web. It's web. Yeah. So that's cool. Um. What? Like, what teachers run it? Um, currently, it is uh, myself, Miss Messer, um, Miss Puta, um, and this year we're going to be welcoming Miss Banquets. Um, mm -hmm. so yeah, it's a new addition. That's very good. Yeah. So, how do you get involved with Link as a junior or senior? Um, there is a uh, recruiting uh, poster that you're going to see. It's a blue piece of paper, um, all around posted all around the school that has a Google Classroom that you sign into. And then we ask you to create a video telling us why you want to be a, a link leader. Um, and so that's that's the beginning process. And then it goes through the selection um, of, of who we think would be the best fit for link leaders. Gotcha. How many new link leaders do you add like a year? Um, it, it varies, but we try to keep it, I think, around um, 20. How many, do you know how many there are this year? I don't. <laughs> yeah, I'm not for sure exactly. That's a good question. Um, I think, yeah, we, we try to have enough for two um, two link leaders per group of 10 freshmen. So uh, okay. it varies on the freshman group. Yeah. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. So the recruiting process, I don't remember doing the video. So is that something new? Um, it is something that some Looking kids back? have, it's some, something that some kids had done. Um, and I think that we really like the idea of it because you really get to see the personality. Yeah. Um, of the link leaders and link leaders need to be, you know, outgoing individuals and um, can handle uh, freshmen who don't want to necessarily mm -hmm. do something because they're afraid of not looking cool amongst their peers. So, yeah, you know, you need a certain type of person that can really draw up the fun in people. And that's, you know, the video helps helps identify that. And I think it's a good way for, for aspiring link leaders to communicate their personality and their wants to do, to do the job. We're also this year going to be doing an ice cream social in which, mm -hmm. um, we're going to have the link leaders who were present this year as kind of a thank you party, but we're going to ask them to bring somebody that they believe is um, going to be a good link leader as well to yeah. apply. 
I feel like I, I did hear about that a little bit from a semester. So like the senior will bring a junior who they think will be a good player. Yeah. Yeah, so it's kind of a way to replace it because right currently we do have a mix. It is open to juniors and seniors, and it's good to have that mix mm -hmm. between the grades because it is, you know, welcoming these high schools. And it's an opportunity for seniors and juniors to help define the culture of the building. Yeah. Now that you talk about that, I remember Miss Messer saying that it's May 11th. Okay, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> and that would be next week. Yeah, yeah. next Thursday. That's next Thursday. Wow, that's coming up so fast. <laughs> So, two weeks. <laughs> you guys excited? Um, it's bittersweet, but yeah. I'm yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready, but like it depends on the day. Yeah, really. yeah. <laughs> Sometimes. Yeah. Well, good. So when you become a link leader, you find out, and I'm like, what do you go through there? Like, what happens? So what happens is you'll be. Um, we get a lot of people that apply to it, and, and um, uh, so we can only have so many. So if you get an acceptance letter, you'll be given um, a, a date to, to kind of show up to the May development meeting. And at that May development meeting, I think it's on 24th this year, um, uh, what we do is um, we basically introduce the individuals who haven't been in the link, in the link refresh those who have been in the link, you know, as to what it is, um, go over some activities and, and basically let them know what it, what it is that they'll be doing and what the goal of the program is. Um, additionally, there's some, some different lessons that are taught for activities to help you keep freshmen occupied and, and to build a team with the group that you have. Um, and it's all, that's all designed to get us ready for the freshman orientation that we have uh, within the first week of the school. Yeah. So I remember over the summer we we did that then. Are you just doing that same thing then? Yep. May? Yep, it's the same thing. That's so funny. yeah. And so then throughout the school year you practice that. What happens? Like, also during the so so the way that it works out is we welcome the freshmen in with a freshman orientation. They go around to different stations and they're link leaders. The two uh, upperclassmen are the ones that lead that and, and kind of guide the freshmen around the school. Um, and then throughout, and then that's the first week of school. And then throughout the, the school year, link leaders push into the classrooms during Eagle time and do different lessons about you know why freshmen can try or um, uh, basically, hey, this is how you get used to the, to the high school environment. You know, high school's for real. It's not like, you know, middle school where <laughs> your grades don't really count. And so it's just, it's it's more opportunity during the school year for upperclassmen to act as mentors to the, to the freshmen. Yeah. Yeah, I remember on um, orientation day, it's just like a bunch of running around with them, basically. <laughs> <And> <laughs> it is. After that, then it's more like group wise. But yeah. Yeah. And then we, we I do remember, remember much of it. When you were freshman, freshman year. Yeah. yeah. I don't remember much of it. It's a blur because there's a lot going, a lot on. going like, on. Yeah, eighth graders, you know, freshmen come in and they're they're blindsided by all the stuff, and so they kind of just follow along. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I feel like I remember my web day a little more than I remember my link day. <laughs> which was strange. Well, did you guys come in during COVID? No. No, we okay. that our was like semester. middle of our freshman year. All right. Yeah. But I don't remember doing any of the activities that I know that we do like this year with the freshmen. Remember them checking up on our grades, yeah. That's good. Yeah. But it's definitely cool that like this year we do that. Well, I think it evolves as, as things change. Yeah. yeah. Especially with everything. Yeah. Oh yeah, we calculated our GPA with our link really? like halfway through the year. Yeah. I'm sure Is that something so that you found to be beneficial if you were a freshman? <laughs> I mean I would I mean if I had the rest of that year, I, I don't know. think I would have, but I think yeah, it was right after first semester ended, then a month later we were done. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. COVID, COVID so, ruined everything. <laughs> I mean, I've only taken one semester of exams in all four years <laughs> of high school, so I, I don't know if I'd say ruined. <laughs> but. <laughs> yeah. So, actually, I take my comeback. I'm sure we did a lot during our freshman year, like that first semester. Just forgot because I don't well, remember doing that. There are several assemblies we do also yeah. during this year. The Hampton Assembly yeah. um, is, a, is a big one. Yeah, we did do that. Some people still remember which Hampton was there. Isn't it cool? I know which one's oh, mine. Yeah. See, that's just one of those things that, um, you know, as you guys are seniors, you, you understand that as you look mm -hmm. back, you mm -hmm. know, as a freshman, it seems stupid. But as a, as a senior, yeah, you're like, oh, I remember that. Yeah. It just, it leads to that high school memory that's, that, that's important for a program. Mm -hmm. 100%. 
I think it's cool to be able to walk by and be like, that was yeah. my hand. And that's a really cool thing about Link is it does, it gives the upperclassmen an opportunity to help shape what the high school is going to look like. So when you guys come yeah. back, you know, for homecoming or, or whatever have you, that you get to see, you know, you get to see Lincoln and how, how, it's, how it's changed or how it stayed the same. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, it'll change a lot. Yeah. This it's summer, <laughs> especially though. It always does, man. Remodeling. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, I'm upset. That's one thing I'm upset about. I want to be able to see that yeah, in action. See. Oh, yeah. Next year. Wait, you can always come back for homecoming. See what it looks like. <laughs> I feel like people That's what homecoming's are, for, right? Yeah. That's true. I feel like people always make fun of like seniors who come, like graduating seniors who come back. They're like, move on. Maybe <laughs> you need to give it a I year. Mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, bye. Well, no, because, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Link's a really cool way to, like, it's kind of a full circle moment because it's crazy to think that I was, like, them. Yeah. Because they're so hyper and we're just, like, so. <laughs> Not, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> or we feel like we're not, but I'm sure you're like, okay. <laughs> it's really good, yeah, it's cool. I do think it's cool because I remember as a freshman, like, I had my link leaders, and then I kind of like looked up to them whenever I'd see them in the hallway, mm -hmm. like, I'd be like, oh, it does, my link leaders, yeah, and it gives the freshmen um, a connection to the school instead of being outsiders because you know how hard it is being the new, the new kids in the school, yeah. So it does give them that, that yeah. welcoming aspect, which does help change the school culture. And like you're saying, like when you that school spirit is something that I think across, you know, across the schools is something that needs to be brought back. And Link is one way that you can help build that, yeah. that school spirit. It, it'll back. help bring. It'll help Link the <laughs> upperclassmen oh. and the freshmen. Oh wow! I wonder if they thought about that when they named it. <laughs> Do you know like who created it? It's a program um, that's created by uh, an organiz organization called Boomerang. Um, how, what we do now is is a variation on that, okay. um, but it, it's a national program. What? I did not know that. No, yeah. I thought it was just something like you teachers created. No, Web and Link are both are both part of this national program. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> yeah. That's really cool. I'm glad you guys are able to. Yeah, I think it makes a big difference. Yeah. I agree. I think it's a great program to have. Mm -hmm. Cool. Yeah. Do you guys know people that you're going to recommend? I'm still thinking about well, it. Make sure you I talk to know. people. Yeah. Talk to people. Yeah. yeah, I'm not very familiar with many juniors, but I'm sure I'll talk to them. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have any more questions. Questions? Any questions for us? No, what are you guys doing next year? I know I talked to you guys a couple times. <laughs> yeah, you can go ahead. I'm going to Michigan State okay. University. Where are you going to study? Um, either pharmaceutical business or optometry. Oh, optometry, that'd be cool. Mm -hmm. I always tell my daughter wants to be a doctor. I said, be a di eye doctor. <laughs> no, ever come, no, eye doctors don't get called in the middle of the night. <laughs> <laughs> Very true. Um, I'm in the the early middle college program. Oh, that's right. You have 13 years. Yes. So I'll stay kind of home. But I'm not home. Would you recommend that to other people? Yeah. Yeah. It's really great because even though, like, I'm not, the program's to get your associates, but I'm just getting it to get my, like, prereqs to get into the teaching program. Okay. So I've gotten, like, a lot. How many credits do you think you'll end up with? Um, I'm not sure. Right now, I don't know the exact number, but if I wanted to get my associates, I'm, like, I think a little over half of it oh, okay. in the last two years. Like this semester, I think they, I think this morning told me I had like 14 credits. Oh wow, that's really good. Yeah, it's the first semester. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, so awesome. Try it out. Well, thanks for having me. Yeah, of thanks course, for coming thanks for down. coming on. We appreciate it. No <laughs> <laughs> problems. <laughs> well, thank you. Yeah. Would you like to give a send off like Mr. Sosowski <laughs> does? Well, I don't. They go <laughs> they go yeah. yeah. You don't how have do to. I, how do I do it? Just, have a great day. <laughs> Have a great day. And I know, and as always, go, go. Eagles. <laughs>